So what is an important kind of truth about financial literacy or money you learned that very few people agree with you about? Ooh, that's a good one. You know, I, I, I don't I don't know if I could say that very few people uh, agree, but I could certainly think of a couple that, you know, would probably raise some eyebrows a little bit. And that is that, you know, I think there's, there's some definite truth in the fact that financial literacy itself can often fail. Uh, you know, years ago, I remember reading an article that once stated that financial literacy is the wrong starting point to success. And that statement really piqued my interest at first because, mm. you know, I had always kind of rolled along with the idea that, you know, the knowledge is power and that's the most powerful tool. But the more I read on it, you know, it was it was so logical to connect that financial literacy programming, you know, often addresses the technical aspects of money, but doesn't always tie in the emotions and the psychology like we talked about that go in tandem with all of that. And in reality, you know, our feelings drive our decisions, not necessarily logic. And while we hope that the ultimate success would be calling upon financial literacy content to influence feelings, you know, that's not always the case. So I, I don't know if I would say that's widely disagreed with, especially today with the amount of information that we have. But I, I know I initially raised an eyebrow at that statement before I became more versed and used that information to really kind of switch gears for us as the credit union and add that you know, that layer of empathy and the concept of listening to understand and not just to respond within our staff education. So I thought that was, you know, definitely a truth that exists out there that maybe not everyone agrees with. 